Yo, what is going on everybody? My name is Connor, but you guys can call me Superior, and today I'm bringing you guys a gameplay that I think you guys are going to absolutely love, and at least from what you guys have told me and the feedback that you guys have given me on the past two videos, I think you guys are going to love, and um, I'm not exactly sure um, if that's actually going to work out that way or not, because you guys have been um, more or less on top of me for spawn trapping, and um, so... You know, I decided to jump into, um, I tried to get, all right, my goal, I woke up this morning, and I'm like, you know what, I'm going to get a gameplay that they're going to love, a gameplay that they're not going to be able to find anything wrong with, they're going to love it, it's going to be awesome, it's going to be great, okay, and so first game on, first game on, I jump into some freight domination, the game you guys are watching right now, solo, I am the only man, like, there's no one else in my party, so it's just me, okay, I'm the lone wolf, the lone rider, okay, all right, I'm like I'm like Batman without Robin right now, okay? Or Robin without Batman, however how you know how however you want to look like that, okay? So I hop in, no support, no spawn trapping or any of that fancy stuff, no honey badger. I took the extra step and I threw away that honey badger. I didn't throw it away, but you know, I hung it up for this game and I put out the Ripper, which a Ripper is a great gun, you know, it's really versatile because it's a submachine gun and it's obviously an assault rifle, which makes it really versatile, but. You know, first game on, I was able to get a solo camp strike with the Ripper, no support, no honey badger, no nothing, no spawn trapping. Um, and I think, you know, that from what you guys have told me, you guys are going to love this. You guys are going to love it. And, you know, you notice most of the gameplay at the beginning, I kind of start off at um, being on, like, the A side of the map. And then, eventually, I flip over to the C side of the map because, like, my teammates cap A and stuff like that. So, um, you know, it's basically me just chasing them in a giant circle around the map for, like, five, six minutes. And I personally, just in my personal opinion... Um, you know, we have to, everyone, everyone watching this video has to understand that everyone was, everyone is entitled to their own opinion. And I don't think gameplays like this are fun to watch. I personally think that just watching one person get a kill every, you know, 10, 15 seconds or something like that, and eventually work their way six minutes later up to a chem strike is extremely boring to watch. I'd rather watch me go like balls deep on like an A flag, just getting like four chem strikes, five chem strikes in one game. So I don't understand, um, why you guys like watching this like i don't know if you guys are gonna like watching this or not keep in mind i can't like see the future or anything so drop a comment down below letting me know if you'd rather see solo chem strikes like this where i'm just running around being like my lone wolf just getting like one chem strike or at best two chem strikes per game or if you guys would rather see um you know me in like a six-man party kind of maneuvering the map and controlling it to the point where i can get three chem strikes or four chem strikes in a game and um, a lot of you guys, like I said, but not me for spawn trapping. And I just wanted to clarify what my own personal definition of spawn trapping is. To me, spawn trapping is where you're like leaning around a corner, aiming down sight, holding down the trigger. Just doing nothing but holding down the trigger. And they just keep popping up in front of you like pop. And you just, you know, you keep shooting. So they're just instantly dead. To me, that is spawn trapping. What I've been doing in my past few previous videos, minus like yesterday's, I don't really think that was spawn trapping at all. But it's been more of like a spawn containment where like they'll just spawn at one flag. But, uh, you know, I'll kind of have to maneuver around the map a little bit to, um, to get the kills that I need. And it's not, not necessarily just holding down the trigger, aiming down sight. Uh, to me, that's my own personal definition of spawn trapping. I do think those are two completely different things. And I want to know what type of game types, not game types, but gameplays you guys want to see. Do you want to see really boring solo gameplays like this or fast game or fast paced game types where I get, um, you know, a bunch of chem strikes? And me personally, I'd rather get a bunch of chem strikes because, you know, when I turn on my Xbox and I play Call of Duty, I enjoy playing with my friends. You know, I don't want to get on and play by myself and it's just all silent and just like, Ew, you know, to me that is just boring. When I turn on my Xbox, I want to hop in, I want to play with some people that like me, people that I enjoy being around, and just have a fun time and just stomp some randoms, and that's what I enjoy doing, you know? I don't claim to be the best Call of Duty player in the world by uploading a spawn trapping hexacam or anything like that, and I just want to know what you guys want to see. Do you guys actually enjoy this type of boring, slow-paced gameplay, or do you want to see a super fast-paced kind of containing the enemies in one general area of the map? Um or or not so drop a comment down below letting me know you know help me help you because this isn't necessarily my channel um as much as it is you know all of our channel because we all we all contribute to it you guys with your opinions and me with the making of the actual video so i do hope you guys enjoyed this video drop a comment down below letting me know what you want to see leave a like if you guys did enjoy this non spawn trapping solo honey badger free gameplay but other than that have a fantastic day everybody i am out